so maybe it's not hard it's just new I was watching a video and in the video someone mentioned how it's easier said than done i'm also someone who is constantly reminding people that like yes it may sound simple and it may sound easy but in practice sometimes it comes off as very challenging and like there's levels to this shit kind of energy i remember i was talking to someone and they had mentioned like maybe it's not hard it's just new and that's what I want to remind you all of. No matter what the practices that you're engaging in, no matter what the goals are, if you feel like something is hard and is challenging, I pray that you remind yourself that it's also new. And that sometimes when things are new, that you have to do it one time, two times, three times, four times, five times, however many times it takes for you to feel steady in it. There are some babies who crawl before they walk, right? Um, and even in their walking, right, they struggle, they fall down, they maybe do a step or two, and then they fall, and then they get back up, and they do it again, right, and they keep doing it, they keep trying, and at some point, it becomes easy for them, right, because they've had practice, they've had time to develop that skill, they had time to work that muscle, and so I want to remind you all that, you know, we are all practicing different things, no matter what that thing is, whether it's mental immunity work, where we're doing mindset work, right? Where we are remembering. Even in the remembrance journey, you will have moments where you are in your awareness. And then there will be moments where you are caught up in the ego. Um, and regardless of where you are, it's okay. You know what I mean? Because you will remember again. And each time you remember, it will be a new experience, a different experience, a different thing and it doesn't mean that you're bad at it it doesn't mean that this is hard and this is challenging it's new it's new and even in these obstacles there are there's clarity there right there is newness there there's an opportunity there and if we just see you know these challenges or these struggles as opportunities gate 28 instead of seeing them as something to try to avoid um our experience will be different. The way we perceive our experience will be different. We probably won't even use the words like this is hard or this is challenging because again, those are just words and those are just perspectives. It's really up to you about what your journey is about. But I wanna remind you that sometimes we can just say this is new. I'm practicing, I'm building my muscle, I am growing my skill in this process and that is okay. You know, it doesn't have to be that this is hard if the idea of this being hard is actually limiting your experience or holding you back you can find a more powerful way or empowering way to talk to yourself about your experiences and so with that i just want to remind you that if it's new and new it can always be new remember because you're never the same person that you were a second ago you're never the same person that you were a week ago um, we're constantly shifting we're constantly changing a lot of things are impacting our design a lot of things are impacting our dna and so you are constantly shifting and changing and whoo there's that right and so i just want to encourage us all to remember that you know we can change the narrative we can shift the perspective we have for one that is more empowering and then that we can remind ourselves that these practices are new that we're building our muscle and how long it takes doesn't matter you do not have to put a timeline on your life on your journey on your experience because that's what people tell you i always think it's funny when people say you're too old to do this i'm like whatever like what the fuck does that mean like okay so you say that's not up to you we get to decide our own stories we get to decide what things mean to us so if the idea of oh this is challenging is not empowering for you how about you remind yourself that this is new and be kind to yourself about this journey all right so i love you i pray that you have your best day on purpose happy motherfucking monday for TikTok, TikTok already had a talk with me about my profanity. And I don't know why. It's just not registering. Because I only curse a little bit. And it's to add sprinkles. You know, it adds seasoning to what I'm saying. So, that's what we do. Anywho, I love y'all. I'm going.